Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. I myself am finally back, and this time with a proper adventure. Start to finish. And today I've teamed up with my buddy Nev to check out a server that is living in the past, specifically the year 1988. It's a different kind of server than we're used to playing, but that doesn't mean that it would be a challenge. This video would be quite the opposite, but now without giving too many spoilers away, let's start from the beginning, when I had spawned in as a fresh spawn on the beach. You know who died to zombies too? You. Me. Because <laughs> you carried them all the way from BMC to the creek. All right, what's going on, guys? Welcome back. Yeah, and today uh, <laughs> we're spawning in with a bag of cocaine, a Swiss army knife, and a bag of Skittles. Tune in to see how this adventure goes. Oh, that shit got a fire, bro. You Open us up. Who the f? Hey. Where my knife at? Don't kill him with the Swiss army knife. Hey man, how are you doing, man? Hey, whoa, 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 whoa! What are you doing, man? Hey, put that away, man. What's up, man? Do you have a mic? Yeah, no. Ah, your shoelace is untied. No, look, look, your shoe untied. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, 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 do it now oh. like a sack of bricks! The Swiss <laughs> Army knife ain't away! <laughs> Give me that! Wow, Swiss Army knife is the cheese, apparently. You should let your time, bro! Look, you! Looks <laughs> like we're swimming, Chief. This is what I knew I was gonna have to do. I had That's to backstab my partner. Far ass can swim. And no unlimited stem, and I'm freezing to death. But a minute. Nah, you might want to turn back. Ah. <laughs> You're gonna die. So, how are we gonna get across then? Looks like we're going all the way around. Wow. Now, this. This is my DayZ right here. Here, let me get the uh, four years ago cinematics when. Didn't know how to use offline mode. Just zoom in in game. Follow you down the road. Yep. Wow. Give me night time soon. We're at the setup shop. Oh. Whoa. It's a SK. Is that back at the camp? I don't know, but my stomach's fucking hungry. We're gonna need to kill this deer. Where the deer? That's right Thank over there. there at that fucking yeah. orange brick. I mean, we could go. But it's kind of off course. I see the deer. You gonna put it down from here? <sighs> Do I got to? Are you that guy? He's on the move. You missed. No, I did not. <laughs> I let you watch blood fly out of it. Why didn't it run? No, that was running. Hit it on the run. Oh, what a shot! A double whammy. <laughs> Another one. Another deer behind it. Another one. What in? Oh, put deer down. Wow. Ah. Uh. Turns out that was actually a guy I killed behind the deer. <laughs> Look at Dude the crows! Did the <laughs> Dude did a deer costume! Dear God, thank you for this mail, thank you for this blessing. Can't tell you the last time I killed a deer and ate it. This is humbling. Take me home! Maybe I just cook it on fire. Ooh, I feel like a roasting on a fucking stick. Yeah, that's it. 
You got a hatchet on you, yeah. Let me get some sticks, man. It's a good house with a fireplace in it. Mustache. I. Wow. Now this is my Daisy. That's gonna be the new hashtag Twitter trend that I'm starting. Hashtag my day Z. Can't wait for <laughs> Billy Bob 1482 to walk into the house with a shotgun. This is my day Z. Wow! I lost everything, but I had one thing left. Hope. Uh, is guy outside? I was about to say that, bro. Guy outside! Where? I don't know. I just heard him shoot. I gotta turn shoot? my filters on. Yeah, he's right outside. I gotta turn my filters on so I can see. Uh, please, go down, go down, go down! Alright, I'm good, I'm good. <laughs> Might just keep right outside, bro. Uh-uh. Talk to him, talk to him. Hello. Hey, who's out there? Uh, we're dead. It's fucking Jason, bro. <laughs> I heard a suppressed just, pistol shoot across the street. He's just, he's just gonna walk in, bro. Kill us both. Get upstairs. I can't burn the meat. I'm upstairs. I knew a fire was a bad idea. I knew it was. It's probably a SK guy. Coming up. Dumpstered. Oh, uh, uh, uh. <laughs> what? Oh, what? You gotta be kidding what? me. Where'd he go? He's dead. In a way. I thought I get one tap. I shot him in the face like four times. Wow. What if I told you dude had MBGs and shit? Nah, I know you'd be lying. Oh, another one, another one. Shut up, shut up. Dude's trying to throw a nade. Oh my god, this dude's geared. Killed him. Oh! Oh, this ain't a nade! Ah! Ouch. I'm going back. I'm getting that gear. I have you. Yeah, I have you some shit. Fuck that is key in here. Well, I think I just heard somebody on me. Maybe. I don't know. I'm dead, so. Run to me. I'll give you cheese. Flashing blood. There's a car here with literally everything. Should I drive it away? Yeah. Again. <laughs> I'm here. All right. In that tree, guys. Wow. What? Got the NVGs for me too. Okay. Yeah, I had to. We can go loot you. In the house. I don't even know what Jeep. I had, really. I was under the tundra. That dude right there has a bag and shit. I'll take the tundra. Alright, let's go to the car. Who's this? Me. <laughs> <laughs> Battle blood loss. Alright, let's bounce. We got a joint. He does. We got a joint. I'm picking that shit up. You have to move it up the tree.
Wow. Yep. Yes, sir. So, we'd have a pretty decent start to the server. Nev had secured us a few lower tier guns after I had died during that fight, and I'd run back as a fresh spawn and managed to steal a jeep during the cover of Nightfall. But now really the best thing that we would get out of all of that was a mysterious green key that would read, Camo Paris Island Biolab gear cases. Like, I, I don't think it's like the big ass hidden lab. Well, that is the bio lab. Is that beneath camo? It's beneath ATC. So that's why we're at Paris Island. And all we would have to do is head down to the underground bio lab and hope that the key would work. Are you going that way? This is the entrance. I think it's open, buddy. Yeah, it's open. Where these locked crates at, though? Could be in Red Room. Oh, here's some crates. It's open. Smoke grenade. All this shit's fucking open. Might just spawn like that. Don't tell me they didn't change the loot table. I think it's probably just red room. Where's that? All the way to the bottom. <clears throat> There's a rat nest down here, by the way. So, uh, stay frosty. Well, I got a CR, so. Look down. I'm seeing like 762 and shit. I'm seeing boom, buddy. Where? <laughs> right there. I'm standing right above it. I'm seeing a stick of C4. Oh, uh, and okay. some clothes craze. Let's go. <laughs> wow. Anybody can access this? You have to have a key to get in there. I don't know. Find out in a second. Us oh, open. Hey, no way this is free to the public. <laughs> Ain't no way. We're gonna be living over here. Can you open up this crate? Give me the stick of boom. Um That's locked. Is there any more? There's a bunch of crates laying around. Let's see if I can open one of these. Oh, that's static. I think it's just this one. Yeah, I can unlock it. Ah! <laughs> that's two si sticks of boom, and the key's still pristine. Oh, I'll take that. That's crazy. Free access to boom? Whoa, 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 Um. Ah. Uh, oh, we can get out. We can get out. We're good. All right. I'm going to jump to the crate. I got to drop a gun. Oh, that didn't work. Here. Hold on to this. Ah, ah. Ain't no way you can open that. What? Coming over. Oh. What was it? One of these. He's got a foul. M1A. Oh, a wow. Doesn't have a mag, but wow. That'll do. Get me out of here. 
profile, we went from humble fucking hunters <laughs> to fucking humble fishermen to gillies. Yeah. Need to get you a mask. Same with me. Yeah. Go to the trader. See what we can do. Ever crash? I crash. Crash him back. I'm like I'm literally frozen on the hill. Yeah, you're lagging your balls off. Why is there a group of zombies right there? It's a guy in ATC. There is. Yeah. I see him. He's coming out. Yeah. Who got a couple of guns? Okay, so I need to pause and explain what happens next. Because from this very moment, I would make one of the most boneheaded moves any content creator can make. And I accidentally deleted the footage of everything else that we would do for the rest of the evening. But it went a little something like this. Nev was having issues with his internet. So while he would log out to reset it, I would make my way down to the airfield at the black market and purchase ourselves a car tent as well as sell a few spare guns that we had got from Paris. From there, we would head towards Waldo to an incoming care package, but would lose our jeep to the ocean along the way. Now we had secured the airdrop and in the process got a single box of nails as well as a few kills. And that's where we would decide to throw down our car tent and a single door in a nearby apartment and log out for the night. And where my footage resumes is the very next day on a fresh life to check out the map and try to find a place for us to potentially call home. Oh, mega base on top of the apartment, the very top of the map. Okay, okay. So early in the morning is when I was first introduced to what would eventually be our neighbors. Now we didn't have a name for them yet or know any of the members in this group, so they would have to remain a question mark for now. Ooh, there's a little military right here, you got another M16. Now I would spend the first hour or so looting around the town while slowly dying to zombie sickness as I would wait for Nev to make the journey all the way up north. And I would also find a pretty unique spot that would pique our interest to set up a base in, but we would have to worry about that later as we didn't have everything to build right at the moment. What the hell is this? I don't even know where the fuck I am right now. Like underground. It's literally where fucking Master Splinter lives. Got to have jeeps and shit in there. <laughs> I literally could. It's an underground fucking parking lot that like goes into a cave. Eventually sickness would get the best of me, but I would get a nearby spawn and quickly grab my gear. Then myself and Nev would head to a large military at Area 42, but we wouldn't find much of anything at all. I don't know, man. There ain't shit here. Oh, that's a blaster. So we decided to just head to Waldo where we had set up our car tent the previous day and we would just grab everything we owned so that we could move to the spot that we had found up north. Oh, I'm gonna die. <laughs> he said, yep, I'm gonna die. I see you running. So, like I said, we would grab everything that we had owned for the most part, but we would have to leave behind the car tent for now since neither of us would have a backpack large enough to carry it. Now, when we had set up the base, we had stashed some extra cash along with some dog tags, which are barter items on the server. And we had thought that we may just have enough to purchase ourselves another vehicle had we sold those dog tags, which would save us a ton of time getting around the map. So we would head to the vehicle trader and see if we could pull together enough cash to buy ourselves a car. can indeed sell dog tags, but I do have enough. I can either buy the Mercedes, the BMW, or the Jeep. How much you have? 40 bands. They're all 40 bands. I'm going to buy the Jeep. All right, hold up. Is this it right here? Yeah.
We're home. How in the hell are you gonna board this shit up? Yeah, I'll show you how. So I'd stay behind and get to work on securing the base as much as I could with a single box of nails, while Nev would head into town to look for more building supplies and to check in on our neighbors to see if they were active. Now I'm up at the apartment, about to see if I can uh, see what's going on up here. And um, yeah, well, you wanna know why there's no nails? It's because every single window at this base, first of all, is boarded up and they built a fucking wall on top of the other wall, all the way around their base. And we go rob every fucking pressure we see. Give us the nails, Kakseki. I know you got them. Drive. Well, we'll go to this fucking key card first. It's even You there. have the great key card on you? Is that your guy up top of that base right now? You have the key card on you? Yup. He is! Oh yeah, he is. We're at the double shoot his ass. It's like up here, is it not? Is that on it? What the fuck, bro? It's a guy in our car. What? He's dead. <sighs> this dude had guns and shit. Yeah, he was geared. Good spot. <laughs> I heard footsteps. I turn around. He's, there he is. Well, this guy. What do you have? A code lock nails? For real? Yeah. Well, going back home real quick. I literally hear footsteps behind me. I thought it was a zombie. I turn around. He's just a fucking dude jogging down the road. Walking right up to our cars. Ah. We need to go back at the car tent. That we do. He's literally up there aiming at us, bro. Stopping. We got zombies coming. I hit him. Did you kill him? I uh, didn't maybe. Kill him. I don't know. Nah, he backed up. 400 meters. I was just dead. So we had found ourselves at a standstill when it came to building, as we quickly ran out of nails. And as we were leaving to go do our red key card, it seemed as though our neighbors were waiting for us. Now we had made it away, but as we were driving towards the key card, another ambush would be waiting for us. Uh, oh! Am I stopping? I see him. Yeah, you can. I'm dead. Where is he? He's straight in front of these trees somewhere. Oh, he's running. He's way, he's like running far as fuck. Stay on his ass. I don't know where he is. He's literally running straight. Oh. Get behind me. Dead. There's another one geared. He's running straight. I'm Can't hitting the fucking road. reload. I don't think he went this high up. He literally was like running beside the fucking guardrail and I seen him like this straight. Well, I don't think tail. he went up at all. I'm pretty sure he's sitting in a tree down there somewhere. Good? He dead. What a fucking scum. Oh my god, he's geared. Oh my god, he's geared. What does he got? He's got a fucking foul, dude. 
Some Love fat ass sniper. This dude's geared as fuck, dude. Yeah, same. We need to go. Yeah, we do. We need to go. Where do we, where, <laughs> where do we go? Do we go back home? Fuck, I don't know. I got so much shit. Oh, wow. Well, it felt good finally having some decent gear on our backs, and we even managed to stop and pick up our car tent that we had left behind earlier and head back to base. See what gear we're working with. We're kind of stacked. That is a lot of gear. Oh, for real? He locked himself in the base. Yeah, he go with a pot of water. I don't do not know if it's clean. Pop there you go, guys. Actually, here, I'll give you the canteen. Give me my pop back. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> oh. 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 Okay. Whoa. The fuck? They're blasting. So insert the boy Matty Triceps, who would be joining us for the rest of the adventure. And shortly after Nev and I would meet up with him, we would get an alert in the server's discord of an ongoing event happening in the town of Sandy Bay. And since Sandy Bay is on our way back to base, we figured we would stop by and we would check it out. It's a little bit dark for my liking, man. A little bit dark. <laughs> yeah, it's about to get pitch black. Oh! oh my lord! Jesus Christ! <laughs> Thought I was a dead man. Think he's got a VG scope? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what fucking police officers in the 1980s are using night vision scopes and shit, and have landmines and shit set up. I'm sure. You know they do. They're somebody in there. Just, somebody jumped. That was to our right. That was uh. No, he's peeking Maddie. PD right now. Where? That window right there. He just walked by it. All black. Wait, wait, wait. There's birds where I shot He's them. literally hiding in the fucking corner right there. Hit him? Might have killed one. He's in that crack right there. There's a bunch of them in there. There's two in this ca uh, cubby right there. I could probably throw a nade over the wall. It's on the left side of that window in the corner. Hit him. Who's doing How's CMS? <laughs> what the talking void? What fucking state troopers got landmines and CMS kits <laughs> yeah. in their headquarters? Eating fucking 308. Feeling a bit gutsy. Oh, Jesus Whoa. Christ. What gun is that? What state troopers have that? One of them just got hit by a trip wire. <laughs> Agent. Sure. That literally would have killed dude, but he ran. They're opening up doors and shit. In the daytime? Yeah. yeah. Someone like... You just, you just got dropped from far as fuck, bro. I need you over here, Maddie. Need me to come over? Yeah. I mean, you got dropped from far. He sniped your ass. 
Yeah, from I the see east him, I see him. on the field. There, 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 on helicopter ping. Guy running along this coast. It's going by that broken house. Yeah, I've got left side if you peek, so I don't know about right there. Right. Hit him. Nice, the gun didn't chamber. Going right. Another one on the rocks. This guy's full gear, bro. Um, Oh, there's a whole squad, three or four of them. I'm lagging, I'm lagging. I crashed, I think. They're not die loading in. They're here, open door. One dead. Throw him back up if you need him on the bottom, holding it. Yeah, dude just got peppered. Like, actually toasted. What's that in the hospital with us? What? I'm dead! Where was he? He's prone in the fucking bushes in front of the door, man. Crashed right in front of someone. Great, dude. There's something crashing in my game in Syria. You're the only one crashing though, so it's on your. Right. Pretty sure I died just then as well. I was right in front of him. That just yeah, you're dead. That dude's literally prone in the bushes outside. You can't even see him, Johnny. One tap me in the head. It's like six of them. What? I didn't trade? Excuse me? So I guess there really isn't much I can do in a 1v6. I would die and run back, and when I ran back to help out Maddie and Emnix, who had made it there before me, I would make a discovery on one of the bodies. Yep, that's where I got shot from last time. Stash bag with boom in it right here, buddy. Okay. Oh yeah, grab that shit. Safe. I grabbed it. Take that shit Going away. to drop it away. <laughs> was, it blue, was it a blue bag? I was white. There's a blue one up there too. <laughs> what? I literally caught the dude placing it down. So after securing both bags and our car, Mia and Nev would return back to base while Maddie and Emnix would stay behind for an incoming King of the Hill event. Garden Lime Trophy, a cassette. Trophy sells for 50 bands, so you guys could buy a boat. And while we had waited for them back at home, there would be some shots just outside our front gate. Where'd he shoot? Not far from us. Like right over here somewhere. Alright. <laughs> oh yeah, here's another shot. That wasn't the original gun. I think I, I just seen something right there. Oh yeah, he's right there. Yeah, he's there. Nice, I missed. Hit him. He's dead. Where'd you kill him at? Right behind that house. Right there. Okay. It's not like super gear, but oh! it's got gear. <laughs> you wanna build a base? What do you mean by that? Look in his bag. Right, I'm coming. We got an MBS rucksack. Stick a boom on him. Alright, I'm, I'm here. Nails oh and shit. my, oh my, oh my. Goons McGee. Goons McGee lurking around town close to our base. Now, we still couldn't be certain whether he was a part of the group that lived in the tower, but we now had the names of two people who I've killed around our base, and it surely wouldn't be the last that we would see of them either. Now, at the same time all of this happened, Maddie and Emnix were en route to us with a boat that they had purchased with the winnings that they had got out of that King of the Hill. Come on in, rat boy. Have a seat. And once the boys had arrived, we decided to all hop in the boat and go north looking for some better gear. Tents. I and an eight man this. on the beach! She got an off cap. Dude, oh, that makes out. dead. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I got a cut. What the fuck? Alright, I'm taking the battery and spark plug. <laughs> wow. 
Wow, oh, good, good that, start. Uh, medic tents. What'd you get? Got an AUG. Oh. <gasps> what are you <gasps> about? Go on, spit it out. What the hell? Dude, shot fireworks. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh yeah, about them crows, by the way. There's actually a guy and there's a guy on the beach right now. <laughs> hey, I'm the distraction. There's a beacon here. How do you dead? Cool, it's the first time I've seen it. I'm gonna go check out these birds. <laughs> oh, got him. Whoa, oh. this dude's fully geared, bro. Really? Yeah. So you got fat ass oh, armor, yes. guns, yoink, <laughs> yoink, clubber. So out of all the places to run into somebody, I had found a dead body on the beach of the most northern part of Deer Isle. There was no boat or helicopter anywhere on the island that we could see, and there were no signs of this guy getting into a fight. So we decided to all hop back in our boat and look around the surrounding islands and see if we could find a base. But that's what I mentioned is there's probably a base in there. Yeah. Like That's why I marked it, check it up. here has some uh, military stuff. I'm just gonna rock up you gotta go like more right. Way more right. Go around all this shit. I have we'll why. Go. There's a bow right oh, there. Oh, there's a bow. There's a bow. Hey, someone's here. Steal that shit. I might, be a, that shit might be a spawn, bro. <laughs> that thing looks sick. I think that's a fishing yeah, that's, that's boat. That's a spawn. That's a spawn. Oh, that's steady. Steady. I don't even think you can get on that. Jump on it, boys. This is an actual boat, fishing boat. Is it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's got everything in it, too. I'm in. Yeah. <laughs> this shit's so stupid, bro. <laughs> Put it in there. Right. This thing does not turn, dude. Put it in the boat. Yo, this thing is slow as Christmas, my guy. So shit. See you later, boys. <laughs> this thing's a piece of shit. There a base there. I think so. Yeah, there's a base. Yeah, that's a yeah. big ass base. What, did they just shoot us? Oh yeah, shit! That's one, that's one, that's one. one on top. We're coming up in oh, a fishing boat. Oh shit! I shoot can't shoot ass. if you don't. I can't shoot if you're not, not holding still. <laughs> I don't want to hold still on this bitch. Are they in the, like the mosque there. tower or are they on the mansion? Uh, on the mansion. On the mansion. Uh, yeah, I see him. He's right there. I. Wow. <laughs> that uh... hurt. I think I hit our boat. I see his dumbass up there right now. Yeah. He's hard scoping us. I'm gonna get a little closer so I can kill him. 500 meters out. Wait, our boat's ruined. Yeah, he's on the corner now. He hit it. Dead. Yeah. Nice. I saw him. Yeah, I saw the blood splash. Nice. Oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> Dude's gonna fall to his death. I can see it now. Dude's they're gonna fall all the way down on the platform. No, 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 no. Okay, I'm good. You're good. Oh, bro, oh. I was nice. <laughs> Dude, no, please. For the love of God, please, no. No. <laughs> Dude boarded up everything. Yeah, I can't get in. He's going to jump into the water and pray to God he makes it. That's a free heli raid, though. Even if I had like a tent to boost off of, I could break it in. Uh, I'm gonna check this moss tower. See if there's anything in there. Bring the boat over, boys! I want to see him die. I'm gonna have to hopefully jump off of this log into a little little pool of water down there. <laughs> That's real close to the beach, though. That ain't even yeah. that deep. There's nothing but rocks, yep. dog. <laughs> <laughs>
I don't know if this log actually has a hitbox on it. I'm about to throw something at it. Test it. <laughs> we uh, test it. <laughs> <laughs> Walk off, fall on his face on a rock. He's just gonna die. Yeah, it doesn't have a hitbox. My rag's went right through it, so... Uh... You got the straight drop, buddy. Alright, boys. Do it. You ain't making it. You're literally gonna hit Do right it. here. You're gonna Has hit to right done. there beneath the other rock. Come on, do it. I'm gonna do it. <laughs> yes, come Please. on. Please! Look at this. Oh! Easy, oh. easy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you got Sweet some food. Sweet mother of God. Oh, yeah, I got food. Jesus. <laughs> Alright, where we going? I mean, the next good island would be uh, so the bottom east. left? That's the damn um, temple thing, right? Oh, yeah, bottom yeah. temple. But All I don't right. know if you can go, go to up sheep, there. Going to the sheep island. Bottom right. Okay, I don't even think I'm going to record all the way over there. But uh, we're headed to the bottom of the map to do a key card at the crater. Yep, he's right at the coast, in the water. Is that... We didn't die, just him in the head. What? He's about to get on the land. He's on con. We can loot him, we can loot him. Where is he? Dead now. He's dead. What buddy have on him? I'll tell you in a sec. Some vest, uh, some like random shit. Kitted MP5, hydraulic fluid. Military rucksack. What's his name? Hawk. Hawk How again? Why did this dude, bro? What's with the heli crash? Crash had an M24 A3. That thing's a supposed to be really good, I think. EOD helmet. Let me get that helmet. I can take this one. Oh, yeah, nah. Uh, AA12. Wow. Of two, three, eight. That'll be a thousand dollars, buddy. No, it ain't. It's about to have fucking juice. <laughs> oh, the razor. Wow, boxes of nails, MVGs, and Alton. Not bad. Not bad at all. Very nice game. I'm the best ever made. Alright. Headed back home. Ah, oh, look in his bag. Come over here. We've been farming, alright. Wow. Be <laughs> the other saw. Yeah, let me, uh, let me add some things in there. So after returning home from looting every island in Deer Isle and hitting the red key card, we would all log out for the night. And in the morning we would head down south to pick up Maddie. And our plan was to sell a few spare guns at the black market. Or at least that was the case until we had spotted something while picking Maddie up. Why is this so like Ah! Uh, dear God! Dear Mother of God! <laughs> oh! Drive! 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 Need to what see if that shit's unlocked. Nah, I gotta get Maddie first. What the fuck was that? What's up, Maddie? The British. British commander. Yeah. Where you get that gun from, buddy? Just found it on the floor. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Alcatraz. Yeah, Alcatraz. Look at this. It's suspiciously parked. I don't like yeah. that. Oh my god! It's unlocked! He's in! Does it have parts? It doesn't have parts, it needs a battery. It says it's it not needs in. A battery. Yeah, it needs a battery. I can't place it in. It needs a truck battery, probably. We're gonna drive oh. the vehicle trader. Damn. Maddie, you have Where's to stay battery? here, hold this down. Oh. Alright, alright, let me hold this shit down. Oh, 
for RA. We're good. Famous last words. There's a trip wire. Watch out. Okay, I'm going to sell all the dog tags here. Yep. I got the truck battery. It's time to bounce. Little fucking rodent with a trip wire. I knew it, bro. I gotta make this snappy, boys. We're back. <laughs> Go ahead and hop in the Jeep. Am I driving the fucking gas? Is Maddie? Yeah. Um, nah, Maddie's gonna drive the Jeep. Put the battery in. Battery's in. Oh, let's go. This road looks hella familiar, boys. It, that it does. Uh, why is this window shattered? <laughs> wow. Just barely. One in, Maddie. Wow. That is a fire ass fucking vehicle, bro. Shit, Maddie packs his in. Oh, dear God, Maddie. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Dude it's smashes hard. right into the wall. There go the taillights. Go crazy. Look at this. My god. We still gotta go to BM. I mean, can right now. I just keep this 22k on me. Alright. We hop in the Jeep. Go to BM. Yep. Well, I certainly didn't have getting a tank on my morning bingo card, but we would take it. And after returning home, we would set off to the black market, which was our original plan, so that we could sell a few useless weapons we had lying around and buy ourselves some much needed storage. Get Maddie. And Maddie forearms. <laughs> Maddie forearms. <laughs> Let me get to sell. Nice case on the ground. Okay, well, I have a green safe, a, a gun rack kit, and a storage box. Somebody's here. Oh. Hey, how you doing, buddy? <laughs> kind of awkward hey, now, hey, isn't hey, it? I'm... Yeah. Definitely awkward. So, uh, more than one, more than one, more than one. What a, what's, what's going on out there? How are we going to set up those, Maddie? Oh, Maddie's flanking. Uh, I don't, don't know how you want to sell this, bub. Well, I know you got more. I don't know it's more than just you. Outside, outside. Open it, open the door, open the door. I need that 308. Bet. <laughs> Dude, that's fucking nothing. They got hit with the mean flank. All right, let's grab the shit. Let's go. I don't know. How do you want to handle this? What do you think <laughs> Dude, this is, buddy? Dude hops out the window. <laughs> I. We got some storage. Not much, but it'll do. What in the fuck? It what was watching us the thinking? whole time. Look up for more. What a little rat.
What's your name? Raven. Raven. What you got for us? Had a bear trap and shit. He's literally just fucking rat scum. <laughs> Watching us build. Kind of crazy. Wait, before you go up on top and tell me what I look like. See, I can't even see you Yeah, yet. you're getting barbecued. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> The fuck? Apartment, dude. I just seen him. I literally scoped in at him. Oh, <laughs> what window? He wasn't in one. He was up top. I'm about to put these planks down in here. <laughs> fuck this kid up. Dude, like. He's up top why? in the window, right? That's where I seen him. Probably more than one. He's laying down in the blue canopy tent. Get below him. Fuck. Let me go talk to him. What do you mean, what do I want, buddy? Yeah, get off your roof. Come down a couple floors so we can talk, pal. Oh. We can talk here. Yeah, okay. Why are you on your roof? for the past fucking five days taking shots at us. What's your problem? Uh, I, I don't live alone here, so... Nah, uh, it's definitely you. You're the same dude. Nah. Uh, nah, that wasn't you laying down in the blue canopy tent in a window aiming at me? Today, yeah. You wasn't the dude up there okay. the other day in the black that I shot in the face? You ate it and just ran inside? You still haven't I mean, answered a question though, the pal. Building? Nah, you wasn't up there building. The He's literally up there aiming at us, bro. We got zombies coming. I hit him. Did you kill him? I uh, didn't maybe. Kill him. I don't know. What's the issue, man? You guys you guys just fucking choose violence when you wake up? You're not friendly people? Why are you, why are you taking shots? Because you are living in our town. Hey, what do you mean your, your town? town? Yo, riddle me this, fucking cocksucker. You got a dude in your group called fucking Raven? What, Goons McGee? Yeah. What's that? What's the other two? Am I speaking Chinese down here? Hello? Yeah, I think he fell asleep up there. Hey, real tough guy. Dude I said it's too. his town. Then dude went silent. <laughs> Yo, new guy. What's y'all's clan's name at least, man? Yeah, he ain't gonna say. But I will tell him one thing. You keep sitting up on your roof and shooting at us, well... Just know that, uh, I may be in your base sooner rather than later. But he doesn't want to talk. That's Guess wild. Not. Game must have crashed. Guess we better blast, because it's his town after all. He's really a bitch. I don't know, man. I think we better just call it and move out of the town. You're right. It is their town, after all. You said you're living in our town. <laughs> um. Oh. Shit. You shooting me? They're shooting at you, Matty. I'm trying to chop some trees, man. So now the story begins to get kind of foggy. Everything was building, leading up to myself and Nev raiding that base. And I would have done it right then and there, but some stupid ass raid schedule on the server prevented us from doing so. So, we'd have to wait. Ain't no way this dude just said that, bro. Dude literally just messaged me, said, Are you guys shooting at them? He said, We have one guy there watching for en route via heli as soon as the server is up.
but when the day came for us to finally raid and I had logged on that evening, Nevit told me that another group already had plans on doing that, and that they were en route to their base in a helicopter with C4. And that moment completely ruined the entire story arc that had been building itself up for days. Nev had got in contact with some of them and we had managed to help out a little bit, but I would ultimately die and give up on helping any further. Get down here! He's on con! I may have, I may have TK'd, I may have TK'd, they're, but they're dead! So tell me, how are you supposed to end a story where everything that you've been building towards is ripped out of your hands and put into the hands of another group? Don't get me wrong, the group that raided the tower were a group of chill guys, who even let us borrow their helicopter after they were finished with the raid so that we could get payback of our own. They didn't block off the patio, boys! They got a door in there? I don't think they do. I don't think they do! What patio? How this get patio, there? buddy! But the feeling and the reward wasn't quite the same. Ah, this is a risk that I'm willing to take. I'm in! I'm deep! I'm deep! I'm coming! I'm coming! I'm coming! I'm deep! I'm coming! So unfortunately, the story would have to end on a blank page. At least for now. But maybe there's more to the story, and we'll look back on the adventures we had while we discuss a new ending. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Dexter, and I will see you all in the next one.